In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to attach images in AutoCAD with the command image attach. And the benefits to this is that you will need to eventually add on-site measurements, plat of surveys, or in this scenario, a Google Earth image. And to attach an image into AutoCAD, we type in image attach, and it will ask where to select the file. And for this case, my file is located on the desktop. I'm going to hit OK and a box like this will appear where we can show more details. It's telling me that my drawing is in feet. We can specify the image on the screen or we can use the insertion point 000, which is located on this point of origin. And we can also specify the scale and the rotation on the screen. I am just going to select specify on screen and hit okay. And we can scale this image up to whatever it is because we are going to use this reference line 100 feet and we're going to scale the image up to 100 feet and to do that I just typed in I just used the polyline command and I'm going to type 100 feet and we could see that the image is just a little bit bigger than the line itself and I'm going to scale this image down with using the scale command And now we have an image that is to scale in our drawing. And we can begin to use the commands within the Home tab to draw out the kind of boundaries of these houses. Um, but the most important thing to know with Image Attach is that the image and the file have to be right next to each other. If the, uh, if the image was in a different folder, let's say if the image was on the desktop but my file name was somewhere located in the computer, those files won't communicate to each other and when you open up AutoCAD, the image will fall off and you'll just be stuck with a bounding box of the image and on the inside of the image, it'll show you where that file is. So you're gonna have to locate that file again, attach it, and then just make sure that both of those are together in the same folder. Subscribe now or go to www.thelandscapelibrary.com for more resources, tools, or trainings.